Get 82 with a video response to a great YouTuber by the name of Maximum RD. Uh, he uh, decided to do a video um, where he wanted to uh, basically let us kind of let him know what is our favorite Dolo 7 video game. Now, for me, uh, James Bond's games, I have not played a, a lot because I know they were on the handhelds, uh, they've been on pretty much every console imaginable. And, uh, yeah, James Bond uh, games are amazing. Uh, as it relates to GoldenEye, uh, he said, no GoldenEye, because that's the main one everybody will probably choose anyway for a video response. Uh, I've only played GoldenEye once, and I've never actually owned it, period, so it wasn't going to be my choice anyway. But, um... Uh, let's see, I played Tomorrow Never Dies for the PlayStation 1. Tomorrow Never Dies was a third person perspective of James Bond. It wasn't like uh, GoldenEye. Uh, I really liked the game. Hard as hell in my opinion. I think I didn't, I didn't even beat the game. Um, but for me, a game that I like and uh, I actually still have is this game right here. This is 007 Agent Under Fire and this was released for the PlayStation 2 and um, put it like this this game really took the Bond games what well, this Bond game took it back to its roots uh, like Golden Eye had a first person perspective uh, you could do multiplayer on here you could uh, like if, if you beat the game a certain way you would be able to unlock certain uh, particular you know perks like having a golden gun which was also like that on the uh, Golden Eye game. Uh, I liked the game, and, and it hurt that when I got this game back, it was only three dollars. So that's pretty pretty cool, and it's complete and it looks pristine. Looks almost brand new. Um, I like this game. Uh, like I say, it, I did beat this game once or yeah twice. Um, a couple of levels that kind of threw me off of the, uh, the driving levels. Um, kind of you know but you know if as you continue to play you get better and better uh I, like i say i played this game i played tomorrow never dies and um played a little golden eye but for me this is a really good james bond game it when, when you first cut the game on the opening sequence will have you hooked to, to want to play the game um as you can see look at those two got twins um, like I said, here's, here's the golden gun right there. Um, there's a, one of the car missions. And, uh, he has a really clean car. I mean, it has a lot of weapons and everything. You have all the, uh, you know, just really cool things that, you know, you expect for a James Bond game. And, uh, yeah, I like my, my, um, Kingstone Light Chicken Monster. Yeah, I just did that. I don't know. Right now, I'm smudging on some stuff, but for me, 007 Agent Under Fire is my pick as um, one of the best uh, James Bond's games that I've played. Now, I know they had another one, Nightfire. I've never played that, but that's one I might want to try to look into getting also. I think it was the sequel to this one. I'm not for sure if this one came out before it or whatnot, but. Yeah, Agent on the Fire. Really, really awesome game. Uh, like once again, uh, to thank Maximum RD for this, um, you know, question proposed of what's your favorite James Bond, uh, James Bond game. And uh, yeah, but anyway, guys, this is Jugged 82 signing off.